6.54 a.m. And we're getting ready to take off to Universal Studios. I hope it's sunny out today so I can actually wear my sunglasses. Made it here to Universal. Getting ready to walk in. All right, so uh, 2017 already better than 2016 because last year I didn't start off going to Universal Studios and Disney. What do you think, Brandon? I don't do that anymore. Oh. So they let us in with our selfie sticks, so I actually get to have fun recording this hunt. Here's a fellow GoPro user. Also with selfie stick. Hey, thank you so much. You're welcome and happy new year. Happy and have new year. A beautiful day. Yes. Thank you, you too. Well already. Amazing service at the front gate so far. She For was real. incredibly helpful. Now we actually know where to go. She was saying if you go to Harry Potter World, do it now, and then you can go okay. back on and go on the ride again. Right, we made it. I don't know how. I don't either. We're about to walk through Harry Potter World. Actually, no. What are? Where are we? We're in Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade. We're not at Hogsmeade. 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 Got herself a wand from who? It's Professor Dumbledore. Dumbledore, I got it. So done in the wand place. That place filled in really quickly, and now I think we're gonna go try some butter beer. Diane said to try all three different types of butter beer, and the best was the frozen. You record so this here is a frozen butter beer. This here is a cold butter beer. Yeah, you can record while you're charging. Brian, what, you, what was ah. your favorite? The cold. You like sure. the cold better than the frozen? Yeah. Yeah, I don't like the frozen too much. Cold's pretty good. Okay, so the sun is out. It's about 50 degrees. And look at this. Flimsy, all right, you ready? Okay, the sun is out. It's about 50 degrees, and look at this. The first time we we're actually able to wear our sunglasses in California. We're waiting in line to put our stuff in a locker so we can go on a ride. And then we're gonna use these, which Emily bought. Thank you very much, Emily. What ride is this? It's a ride through Hogwarts is what we're doing right now. Oh my There's some talking paintings. Like, they're kind of freaking me out. Holy crap, man. The ride was absolutely insane, and I cannot wait to show you that. I, re I recorded it. They said that the dude warned me when I walked in that they would take my selfie stick away from me and make me throw it away, but I hit it, so I recorded it a little bit. We're right here, waiting in line for a nice little roller coaster right now. This is going to be pretty cool looking. Yeah, right? Looks like they made out of wicker, but I, r I really hope not. You got it recording, Brandon? Tame little roller coaster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
think that was probably the shortest roller coaster I've ever been on. I'm very glad that I fast passed it because I don't think I'm coming back to it. <laughs> yeah, no. I'm glad I experienced it, but yeah, that was probably a good idea. Yeah, because we would have waited in that line, that would have been sad. Yeah, it was nice and relaxing, I guess. Hey Blake, first try. They have a solid gold thing kept to their cash register. Oh wait, I don't think that's solid gold. He's tucking himself out. Oh my gosh. There's currently 13 people in here. I'm liking it. We're in Honey Dukes. I don't know. I don't think it's all that great. They have more of the candy stuff than they do chocolate. <laughs> Somehow we're at Hogwarts and we didn't even take the train. But there's the train. I think we're gonna take a picture in front of it. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go to things and then we're gonna go eat at the three broomsticks. It's that place right there. Brandon, what'd you get? Beef stew. Beef stew. Emily, what is that? What did I get? It is the Sunday beef roast. Beef roast. All right, I got something called bangers and mash. All right, all I'm eating. Food is very good. Emily told me that this next ride we're going to is the best ride in the entire park. It's 4D Shrek. Brandon also thinks it's the best ride in the entire park. I'm not sure what I think about it yet because I've never been here before. Ogre vision. It's all ogre now. Shrek. 4D. Emily is going fast right now. Genji, no, we'll save you, don't worry. There's no video recording allowed during the show. So I'll just tell you how it was afterwards. Shrek in 4D was kind of cool. I think the 4D could have been a little bit better though. There wasn't any, it wasn't wind from the front. There was a, there was a point in time where a dragon would like blow its breath or something and like hot air would hit you from the back. I mean, other than that, it was pretty good though. Currently, the wait to ride the, the ride Simpsons right ride is over an hour. Yeah, I guess. But, fast pass lane, we're probably gonna get in like 10 minutes. Okay, so the Simpson ride was pretty fun, but now we're getting into what I'm really excited about. Uh, Jurassic World ride is down here. We started, started way up there. We're gonna take a picture of the dinosaur. Very good. As I was saying, guys, their name actually comes from a compound Latin phrase. You would think after the movies that they would stop letting them do this, but here we are. 
this is pretty dangerous. Think you're pretty gangster. Uh oh, after that one. That didn't sound good. Oh no, where are we going? Oh, uh, we broke the electric fence. We should, I think we should have went the other way. Who's driving? Oh my gosh! That was heck of a drop. Come on, me. It says 50 minute wait time. How about five? The mummy was a very impressive one. It was very fast. Oh, yeah, I think it is. I opened it. It's owning the GoPro. Get on our way to go, run away from some zombies. Yeah. Try to figure out how to get out of a zombie maze. Isn't this dangerous? Just a little. Slightly. How do people put themselves in danger like this? Because For fun? Of the thrill of it. YOLO. YOLO. <laughs> Alright, here we go. That was pretty real. <laughs> that was pretty scary. That zombie, he hit me. I was glad I ran into him. Yeah, Brian ran into a zombie when we were I saw that. It came out of the corner and we're like, yeah, I was like, the hell are you doing, I'm feeling awful curious right now. All right, in line with Curious George. Got all my shopping done. I'll just go back to the, maybe get some food, do something. I'm not too sure yet. What are we doing? We, they don't know either. We're just gonna, we're winging it as it goes. Here's George! Brandon's over here doing a video, taking up a spot from everybody. Sitting outside Universal waiting on a Lyft driver. I guess Lyft was five dollars less than Uber. Although our the security lady that works here is very biased against Lyft. She said Uber is better. I look at the prices for both apps every time and Lyft is always been cheaper. So we're gonna keep sticking with Lyft for now. Alright. Just got out of Lyft. And we're here at the Santa Monica Pier. Mom and dad said they're gonna meet us right down there, so we gotta walk all the way down that bridge. Just my GoPro. <laughs> Are they just recording each other? Yeah, they were for a minute. <laughs> this whole back room is completely open. It's pretty cold out there too. Luckily, we, we can talk to them and let us sit in the back though. This is probably the biggest burrito I think I've ever attempted to eat. This is just halfway through it, and that's about the size of a Chipotle burrito right there. Maybe a little bit smaller, but it was probably about that big. I forgot to show it to you, I'm sorry. I was pretty excited about just eating it. <laughs> Definitely recommend Casey Barn. It was actually really good. Get a the ticket. Where are we at? Santa Monica? Santa Monica Pier? Santa Monica, Santa Monica, Santa Monica Pier. Pier. The Santa Monica Pier. Currently, 6:44, and we're walking. That back there is all. That's the Santa Monica Pier. This is the beach, and our car is way up here somewhere. I'm not sure. They haven't told me yet. I haven't seen it. There's a the minibus. Yep. Yeah. Back at the hotel. The time is 10:14, and we're all ready for bed because we got to wake up tomorrow morning at 4:30. Maybe 4.15, and then we have to be out of the house by 5. But that's it for this vlog. I didn't want to give too much away of Universal. I want you guys to go out and experience it yourself.